Hey, what's up, number 1201? Uh, man, we're so grateful and proud of you for confessing your sin. And uh, man, it says here that you struggle with self-doubt. Um, man, one, I want you to know that you're not the only person to ever struggle with self-doubt. And I'm going to go on a limb here and, and say I think I know what you're talking about when you say this. Because uh, it's something that, um, that, that I've struggled with in the past. And so... Uh, self-doubt, not believing in yourself, not believing you're good enough, not believing you're fill-in-the-blank enough. Um, and man, I want you to know that um, you're not perfect. Uh, don't heap all this pressure onto yourself to be perfect and to have all the right answers and to be able to have all the quick comebacks and witty sayings and have all the friends and um, man like that, you're just heaping way too much pressure on yourself and I want you to know Psalm 139, uh, King David uh, tells us that, um, man, we are fearfully and wonderfully made, that God knit us together in our mom's womb. Um, and, and, and what that means is a couple of things, right? It has a couple of implications for us. One, uh, if God is who he says he is, then he does nothing on accident. And if that's true, that means, number two, if he knit you and I together in our mother's wombs, then that means he made you on purpose. That means he made you with all of your quirks and all of um, the things that make you, you. Uh, he did that on purpose. And man, that's a good thing. And so dude, I just want you to know that God loves you. He made you on purpose. He has a distinct reason and a distinct plan that only you can do as you walk here um, for your time on earth. Uh, the days that God has given you. And I want you to know that he's given you a purpose, that you do matter. Uh, so, man, like, don't don't heap all this pressure on yourself where you're trying to fill in the blank of I'm not blank enough or I don't have enough friends or I'm not funny enough or cool enough. And man, I'll tell you this, man, you, you never will be. Um, you're never going to be good enough to fit into every single situation. And, and no one is, man. But uh, we're not to heap all that pressure onto us. We're to trust that God has made us the way he has made us on purpose and and lean into that and go, God, you made me this way. What was the purpose behind it? And how can I accomplish what you have um, given me to accomplish with the days, with my days here um, on earth? And so, man, number 1201, I want you to know, like I said uh, a few minutes ago, man, it's something that I struggle with and still struggle with. I, I was in counseling for eight months um, dealing with this. I was believing this lie about myself that I'm not blank enough, fill in the blank, whatever adjective you want to put in there, I was believing that. And so, man, number 1201, if you ever want to talk with me about that, um, man, I would, I would love nothing more than, than to do that. If you want to talk with Corey or Brennan or Noel or, or someone, a godly man or woman that you trust, man, please do that. Uh, we would love to talk with you about that. But number 1201, we love you. So proud of you for confessing your sin and uh, let us know how we can help you.